5 and 0. Take a bit of time with this one. And let's just bring the bishop here as we do. Preventing the fried liver attempt. Let's attack the pawn. Make space for Castellan. Let's take the pawn. So we push this pawn so that it's not coming down onto our knight. Doesn't stop it, it's just that we can at least take it back. Let's bring the bishop supporting. <clears throat> Castle. Do you know what? I bet you missed opportunity. Let's just flip back. Knight's got no protection on. I could have just taken the knight off the board. Oh, you know. Feel sick. Let's just. Unbelievable. It's weird how your, your brain goes into sort of a motor set type thing. Let's take this pawn for free. So is that a little bit of compensation for missing taking the knight? Brain just goes into some sort of motor set mode. Knights hunt the bishops in our mantra, but it doesn't mean that we have to take the bishop in this occasion. But it is taking the bishop off the board. Let's just take it off. Bishop's got sights here. Is there a potential for this situation? Looks a little bit too obvious, but shall we attack the queen? give them something to think about while the kind of plan is to try and get the queen here opposite this pawn I bet you any money this pawn pushes that gives us the excuse to push here yes so we push here obviously the queen can't get to this spot so the plan is to try and do something like this obviously he's just going to push here maybe the bishop's just going to get trapped yep okay so we're going to come back could come all the way back here I'm going to attack the knight bishop still got this position here so the queen could look to come here to go here Obviously, that's going to be prevented because the bishop's going to attack the bishop. But we're trying to make a plan. <laughs> exact move. <laughs> oh, dear me. The exact move. So we're going to attack and then we'll attack the rook because it's got no protection momentarily. If the queen comes across, we can attack, but the rook can take. So we... Queen does come down. It's attacking the pawn. Still defending the rook, so we could take the knight. The rook takes, it's also on this pawn as well as the queen. How do we want to play this? Let the pawn go, let them greedy munch, get the rook owning the file here. Or bishop just taking the knight off the board, rook takes. Queen jumps here, but there's nothing, it's attacking. Mm -hmm. Interesting, we're plus one, so we don't need to be greedy, we can allow the pawn to be taken. Improved position. Bishops X-ray through to their rook. If we hit here, I'm gonna hit here because then it's baiting the queen to take the pawn. And then the rook can take well attack the queen.
and then obviously his rook is under threat if he does actually take the pawn anyway ah, so they're not doing that so the smaller piece attacking the higher piece could work because he's probably going to sit here now because he's wanting to protect the rook No, he's gone there, right? Okay, so let's bring the rook here and then he goes here. Or oh, maybe he goes there. He's got places now where he can support the rook. All right, okay, so we, could we potentially look to own the file then with the rooks? Just bearing in mind, he's going to be attacking our queen because he's, he's going to be a bit annoyed. Yeah. All right. Let's bring the queen here. <clears throat> Again, it's probably going to be touching onto the queen. Can't take this because the queen's protecting. Yep. Every move so far. So we could swing all the way back. If we came here, we're getting kind of trapped. So let's just bring the queen back. We're trying to fight to get ownership. It's going to move this rook now because he's not going to be wanting the x-ray with the bishop anymore. Unless, of course, he's just going to tap the bishop and say, I want you to take the knight. So yeah, so he has moved the rook. Does that give us time? Can we get this doubled here? And if he hits, then we can. Yeah, okay, let's go with the doubling. Keep it simple. Time is not too bad. All right, so um, if we take this and then we get the queen off the board. So that's a stroke of luck. Okay, let's take the queen off the board. They're still playing on. All right, okay, so shall we attack this pawn? It's got no protection. Let's put a check on the king. Right, don't go into narration. Okay, let's put a check on the king here. Don't go into narration mode and fluff it all. King has to move so we win the rook. Right, looks like they've left the game. That was an interesting game. Okay, 5 0. Oh. Let's hit the pawn in the center. Let's grab the pawn, attacking the queen. Let's take the queen off the board. Yeah, you, you'd love games to be like this, wouldn't you? <laughs> uh, Okay, 5 and 0. Let's push through the center onto the pawn. Let's grab with the knight. Let's take. So it is five minutes, so there's plenty of time. Let's try and find the appropriate moves. Ah, they've not gone for. Let's castle. Let's develop the knight supporting the pawn. Let's develop the bishop. Let's give the king some company. Oh, he's blocking. Okay, let's just um, bring the bishop here. Let's attack the pawn. Let's make some space. Let's grab. Let's grab. So, destructed my king's castle but hopefully for improved position on the board just coming down for the pawn here could take bishop to the left yeah let's just simply support let's grab this queen okay 
Let's attack the rook. Take. Bishop's down, attacking the rook. Rook can come and... It's on a white square, dark square bishop can attack it as well. So come in here, white square bishop can come and attack it. Interesting situation. We do have a little bit of a sneaky maneuver. But I think the bishop's going to come back. Oh, he's blocked it with the bishop. That means the knight must be able to do something. Let's get the knight here. Can it dance a bit? Maybe not there, the white square bishop around here. Something. Nope. Oh, no, he's coming for the pawn. Bring the rook up. So I'm play, playing defense nanny here. Oh, not like this. Oh, yeah, playing defense nanny now. I need to try and find something, but it doesn't look like there's anything clear to find. Yeah, rook comes down, bring the rook up. Maybe he puts checks on. King's got a bit of a safe haven here. As for this one, push. We don't like these sort of games where nothing really looks like it's happening at all. Well, for us. And they just slowly but surely rinse you out. Rook can't come anywhere here. Ah. Hmm. Let's see if we went and attacked his rook. His rook goes to there. If we went here, we can just go here or here. If it goes there, we can push. But then this is going to be coming. Yeah. I think my, my rook is done for. Knight. Bishop still comes. Time. Nope. Let's put the check on. It's not going to help much, really. It's just as. Is it still going to get our rook? Damn. Maybe I should have taken with the rook. Oh, that's a shame. Come back here. Where does the rook go? I suppose it can jump up here, but um, oh, never mind. Never mind. You know, when you don't stand a chance, you think, oh, yeah, look straight away. Boom. Oh, I didn't even see it was a double whammy. I didn't even see it was a double whammy. Oh. Checkmate. Bishop. Well, it's not checkmate, but I can't go anywhere. Then he comes back and gets the rook. Oh my gosh. He's not seen it. I think they're playing with me now.
I'm just putting my time up. Just let my time run out. What are you doing? You should have just let my time run out. Now you've gone all giddy and lost your rook. And you've had to resign. That's a damn shame. 